Welcome everybody. So this video is about the introduction to the breadboard. Now, if you look at this breadboard carefully, these are actually two breadboards yoked together. So from here till here, we have one breadboard and from here till here, we have another breadboard. Now, if you consider this breadboard, the one at the bottom, then uh, in any typical breadboard, we have three, uh, three sections. So this section is for the power rails. This section, which is separated by a partition, is where we build our circuit. And this again is for the power rails. Now, in the uh, section that contains power rails, the dots are connected uh, horizontally. So what do I mean by that? If we have a wire plugged in here in a dot, and we uh, have another wire plugged in another dot and uh, both of these wires are uh, the, both of these dots are uh, in the horizontal line then they are both connected however if we place the, these vertical in a vertical fashion like if uh, both are in the same line, but they are vertical, the line, uh, the line is vertical, then they are disconnected. However, in this section, uh, we, which is separated by a partition, uh, the, the, there is a group of five uh, dots and all of them are connected. Now, if we, we choose one particular dot here, anywhere here, and another uh, dot which is in the same uh, vertical line they both are connected but if you place them horizontally they are disconnected now they are separated by uh, the partition and if uh, you place them in the same vertical line they again are disconnected One of the common mistakes people do is they, uh, whenever they have to build a circuit and uh, they need, a, suppose if they need a chip for that, they place it here. But as I said, in this section, uh, all the vertical lines are connected in a group of five. So if you do that and place it like this, then there's going to be a short circuit. So this is the reason why uh, there is a partition which uh, disconnects these uh, vertical lines. And uh, then you have to place the IC chip in between these two partitions to avoid the short circuit. 